Well, we're taking our first trip in quite a long time. It's been about four months since we've gone anywhere. We're headed to Atlanta. What all are we gonna do in Atlanta, Callie? Go to the aquarium and, um, in the zoo. And the Braves game? In the Braves game. Yeah, the aquarium, the zoo, the Braves game. We're staying at Stone Mountain for three days. Uh, should be a lot of fun. Uh, looking forward to getting back on the road. And the hardest part is probably gonna be getting out of our driveway. Uh, we have a pretty tight turn getting out, but we got a three or four hour drive and then we're gonna be at our campground. We're gonna have some fun this week, aren't we, Cal? Yeah. Let's go. ever rusty at this today we haven't been in like four months i haven't set this stuff up i had put the slide out out before i leveled it when i backed in i couldn't get my water hose to connect because i had pulled too far back i had to redo this thing like five different times uh we're definitely out of practice i know everybody probably thinks we're like the newbies here we just watched our camper it's like sparkling clean uh, i bought new blocks and some new uh, wheel stops and everything so everything looks like we got brand new stuff so they probably think this is our first time we've ever camped uh it's really, really frustrating. We had a difficult back end. It has a really steep slope and a big ditch in it. So that was difficult, but finally got everything unhooked, uh, getting it leveled uh, now with the slide out, which was not ideal having to crawl up under everything. Uh, but we got here and this is a really, really nice state park. We are at, um, we are at Stone Mountain State Park in Georgia. Uh, that's where we're gonna be staying the next few days. And it is super, super nice and great weather. <laughs> See, this is the kind of stupid thing that happens when you let the slide out, out before you level and chalk everything. <laughs> He's trying to keep her from flying down the hill because she doesn't know how to stop herself on her bike. It's the first time on open roads with her bike. have a little change of plans how we're doing our trip. Uh, Carolina woke up at 6.15 this morning, bright and early, I guess with the sun coming in the camper. Uh, she's used to sleeping in basically darkness. We have at our house at home, we have the, the light darkening or however you say that, the, the blackout curtains at our house. And so she's used to that. So at 6.15, she was up bright and early this morning. Um, and if Carolina does not get a nap, it is not good news. So um, last Friday, we went to the Braves game and Carolina didn't have a nap beforehand and it was literally just wrestling her the whole time. Uh, so instead of going to the zoo today and then um, go to the Braves game tonight, we're just gonna go to Ikea, uh, do a little shopping there. Don't know if we'll buy anything, but we do a little shopping there uh, and then go to the Braves game tonight. I think we're gonna eat lunch at Mary Max, which is my favorite place, Mary Max Tea Room. If you're not eating there in Atlanta, definitely a must eat at place in Atlanta. So we're gonna go there for lunch, come back home, do a little napping, 
uh, and then go to the Braves game. I'll talk later about why we're going to so many Braves games. Uh, but So we're going to scrap the zoo. We'll go to the aquarium tomorrow instead. Um, but we just did not want to do that with Carolina. So we're going to get on the road and head towards Atlanta. It's about a 20 minute drive over there and then do a little exploring today. What did you find? What did you think about this store, Callie? Good. Did you like it? Yeah. Are you tired now? No. No, you ran you ran from one thing to the other the whole time. Um, look at the sky. The sky. We're laying in a bed with the sky. What was your favorite part? Everything. Everything. So now we're gonna go eat lunch at Mary Max. Um I've only been there once. How many times have you been there? Just I think once. once, yeah, with you. And it was really, really good. Um, it's been like several no, maybe years. I've been slight I don't know. I've been. It's been several years since I've been, um, but it was really, really good. And so we're gonna go to Mary Max and Callie's. What have you been singing all morning? Mary Max, 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 all dressed in black, 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 black. Everyone's got to hold down her black, black, black. Yeah. So she's been singing that all morning because we're going to Mary Max. But she loved IKEA. Like I did not think she was gonna like this place, and she. I don't know that we're even gonna go to the zoo or the aquarium because she had so much fun here. She ran from like place to place to place, <laughs> jumping on every bed, every chair, loved every little kitchen. It was funny. She had so much fun. Um, I lo we love the story Carolina anyway. Didn't. No. So we're gonna go eat some lunch. We're hungry. Um, I don't like that place very much. Yes, you will. I promise. Are you weirded out by this? Yeah. You. Me? Yeah. She's like, she's doing the splits. Is she? Mom, uh -oh. she's making her wear face. Look at her legs. <laughs> she's making her wear face. <laughs>
Well, last night's game was a blast. Uh, I said I was going to talk to you about the Braves. Uh, we ended up buying the 27 game A list membership this year uh, for the Braves. Uh, so we got 27 games to go to. The reason we did it um, was because the All Star game was going to be in Atlanta. And uh, yeah. to have make sure that you had access to the All Star game and home run derby tickets, you had to be an A list member. So I did that and was greatly looking forward to the game being in Atlanta, having the home run derby and um, All Star game because I honestly never thought that'd be something I'd be able to go to. Um, and then they moved it out of Atlanta, and I've been really, Why? really mad about it since then. Um, I had tried to give my uh, season tickets back to Atlanta, try to get my money back for my season tickets. They gave me money back for the All Star game, try to get my money back for the, the A list membership. Hasn't happened, uh, so I guess we'll be going and enjoying a bunch of Braves games. But last night's game was fun, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. She got her a foam finger because we left, left our, what did we leave at home? Um, our, my Tamahawker. Her, her Tamahawker, she left at home. Uh, so we had to, <laughs> we got her a, a foam finger and we got it's some dipping dots. What is it then? It's a finger number one. A number one finger. Mm -hmm. Um, and we got us, did you get some ice cream? Yeah. And a helmet. That was great. <laughs> uh, so we had a great time at the. And I think. I forgot my helmet and mommy's diaper bag. Yeah, we still got it at the house. Yeah. Uh, so we had a great time at the game. Looking forward to a bunch of good games this year. Uh, coming back over here to Atlanta and watching a bunch of games yeah. uh, for the Braves. So that'll be fun. Well, we're going to go to the aquarium. It uh, should be fun going to the aquarium, looking through everything uh, and mm -hmm. um, enjoying our time there. What do you think, Carolina? What do you think, baby? She does. She's gonna throw up on her. Yes.
We've had so much fun um, the past couple of days getting away and um, just exploring. We've uh, done the aquarium and the Braves game and we went shopping at Ikea and just all that random stuff. Um, we did make it to a little bit of Stone Mountain Park. We drove around. Um, We've been camping here, but this kind of like a yeah, home base. Yeah, we stayed in the we campground, didn't... but we didn't, ha we didn't get, have much time to do like the stuff in the park. Um, There's a we, bee up here. <laughs> but we drove around and um, we played on the playground here at uh, Stone Mountain and yeah. we definitely want to come back and do like the laser show and they've got like a ropes course and Chris mini Mill. golf and they've mini got golf. like trails and they, they got the sky hot the sky the summit the skyline oh, the skyline is. you can ride the top yeah. of the Stone Mountain they've yeah. also got hikes up to it they've got a train that rides around none of it's open yet we're here in late April no. all of it opens like the first of June when all that stuff opens yeah, yeah. So we're gonna come back for sure. The campground is amazing. Like we want to come back just to stay in the campground. Um, but Callie's had so much fun. Yeah. Um, we will for sure be back. But we're gonna wrap up tonight with um, some s'mores and um, maybe oh. a walk in the park. One last walk in the park with the family. We've missed traveling. I know y'all yeah. noticed for like since tw since the summer of 2019, we've not done a lot of traveling. I mean, COVID happened last year, but also this, this one happened last year. So it's really limited our travels. Yeah. Um, hang on a second, baby. So we've we've really missed traveling. So it's nice, even though it was only three or four days out, it was still really, really nice to be out and about again. What do you want to say, Cal? Um, I have never made s'mores. It's been a while since you made it, but it's yeah. been a while. So we're going to go uh, finish playing, go make some s'mores, and then pack up and leave uh, in the morning bright and early and get back to a little bit of taxes. I'm ready um, to plan our next trip. And we are definitely getting the travel itch again to, to get out some more. So uh, we did not have any uh, firewood? sticks to um, put into our marshmallows or, or firewood. any firewood. So we're doing what you call a redneck s'more. You made one already? You gotta, you gotta heat the marshmallow up. <laughs> That's all she wanted to do. Well, Callie didn't even want to heat hers up. She just stuck it in there. So, look. Yeah, look. Actually, she just wanted the marshmallows. She just wanted to eat it. <laughs> Is it working? Um, it may take a minute. Uh, three minutes on five, at least five or something. What? It may take a while for me to eat this marshmallow. How does this make you feel? This makes me feel like we did not spend two years full time camping. That's what it makes me feel like. This whole thing has like trying to set up was a pain in the butt. I backed in like three times. I never back in three times. Um, trying to get when I set it up, the water hose didn't even reach the water, so that was a pain in the butt. And so now we've got this. So it's like, hey, we spent two years living in our camper, but now we don't know how to do anything. <laughs> or maybe you do know how to do it. Hmm? Or maybe you do know how to do it. That's why you're using a knife. On a grill with it's, it. it's true. This is some advanced bear grills kind of stuff right here. Um, that's for you, Lala. We'd have been here all night if I had to wait on that marshmallow to cook like that. So we got a it's a little squidgy. But if you like Oh look, your, it's melty. Oh it is melty. Look at that. Um <laughs> if you like your marshmallows um burnt, you would definitely I would not recommend this method. Do you want one? Is that the problem? <laughs> now my turn. Go <laughs> good. You want one? How do I get the graham crackers? I'm gonna lick it. What's uh Sydney's expert review of the of the graham cracker? I mean of the s'more. Stone How many stars? Okay. So two stars. It could work. I'm just stuck in the microwave. I mean it could be good. I've never done that before. But it will get I like mine. Like my marshmallows, like black burnt. Like catch it on fire and let it burn for a while, and then it's done. But I mean, it's pretty gooey like this. Carolina likes it. Look, even even a redneck s'more is better than no s'more. I agree. What's your review? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Yeah. What a hundred stars <laughs> would recommend. Whoa. Pro tip, take the grate off of it. Now watch. Oh, Sydney approved ones. Yes, ma'am.
Oh okay, so actually I've changed my opinion a little bit. This is like the best idea ever. Cause you know what we do when we're done? Turn the grill off. We don't have to sit out there. You don't have to buy like $8 for the wood. Or sit out there and wait for the fire to die down or get covered in smoke. I don't smell like smoke. I don't have to worry about a fire. I think that might be the point of s'mores. But like, we're just gonna turn this grill off and just go on a walk. Ready? You know what we should have done? It's gone two campers over and asked him if we could stick a marshmallow in his fire. That sounds dirty. <laughs> and then be like, thanks, man. I, I like the chocolate the best. <laughs>